my god, that is the most haunting thing I think I have ever seen. <gasps> no, I don't like that. Why, why do your eyes look like that? That is so scary. It's like a horror movie creature. Oh my gosh. It literally looks like it's missing eyes. Does it ha not have eyes? Doesn't it look hollow? Oh my god, I don't think it, I don't think it was born with eyes, you guys. This one, she's got look at her eyes. She's got eyes. You can see them peeking through. This is so scary. Oh, but you're so cute. You're a cute one. What happened to that one? Where's the scary possum one? Is that the wig one? Hi. Do you have eyeballs? Are you missing? Oh my god. I don't see any in there. Oh wait, no, I think I do. Why are they so little? Uh, good day, everyone. That was shocking, haunting, terrifying. I'm glad that there are eyeballs underneath there. At least I think there are. Was not expecting to come in here this morning and see all their eyes like partially opened. I guess they all just develop in their own unique ways. So who am I to judge? You know, there's always that one that just is a little more awkward than the rest. Oh my God, they're all like moving around now. So cute and very interesting. <laughs> very, very interesting. You guys see the difference though, right? Like her eyes are very different from these ones. Like it almost looks like her eyes are like just dots, like a ditto, like it's a, a copy. Like it's trying to impersonate these kittens. And these are like actual kitten eyes. <laughs> it's a ditto. Maybe that should be its name, ditto. Oh, this one still hasn't opened her eyes. Oh, you're trying to open your eyes. You have one little open. You are a ditto. Oh my God, the yawns are so freaking cute. Hi, mother. Oh. Do you realize you have an impersonator here? You have a fake kitten. It's a Pokemon. The Pokemon ditto. It's not real. How do you feel about that? having a little break. So if you guys remember, I am planning on doing a shoot where I'm a Death Knight Blood Elf from World of Warcraft. And I ordered these crazy long elf ears online on Etsy. Oh my God, they look so wild. But I couldn't just do like little tiny elf ears like I've done in the past because that doesn't fit the character. But it seems a little large for my ear. I'm not quite sure. I also ordered some wigs. Let me put a wig on and <laughs> We'll see, we'll see about the wigs. <gasps> oh my God. I went for two different looks. I went for like short and long. The short is a definite no. This is definitely not the vibe. Okay, this is another one. She's long. This is giving very Lucius Malfoy vibes. Come on, inches. This is also, I don't think the one I've already tried these on. And I mean, I might be able to make it work if I like add like a ton of like little braids in and make it like super whimsical and elfy. I don't think this is the look either. Although it does kind of go with the Lich King. I feel like the Lich King has this like long, straight, straggly hair. See, that is kind of his wig, but I don't think it's gonna work for me. Okay, I think this wig I can definitely work with. I also just might not wear a wig at all. Okay. See, she's kind of gorgeous. Like this, this definitely feels more like Lord of the Rings fantasy-esque. See, this is cute. I think this is going to be the one if I do a wig, if I choose to do a wig, which I think I should because it will fully give the fantasy. I have some costume pieces that I'm borrowing from my friend Kate. There are some like cosplay armor pieces that fit really well with this look. Here's some like arm bits. And I don't know, I'm just excited. I'm so thankful for her for letting me borrow these pieces. Anyways, I need some energy. I need some caffeination. So I'm gonna go run and grab a matcha and maybe a smoothie from my favorite place, Air One. So let's go head over there. Oh, Mooney, you want to come with me? You want to go on a little adventure? All right, I got my matcha and my smoothie. I decided to try a new mermaid smoothie they have. Oh my gosh, I don't even know what the flavor is. I can't even like describe the like flavors I'm tasting. But I also got my matcha. Can't go wrong with the matcha. Let's head back home, check on the kitties. Hopefully their eyes are looking a little more normal. I also need to do some filming today. Okay, 
So all the kitties, there's a crow on her own. Mother has been devouring her food left and right. Like literally just destroying it. Yeah, you crazy girl. You are just a hungry woman. Go see your babies. Go see, oh, she loves her babies. Her babies love their mama. Was that a yummy breakfast? Yeah, you feeling better? That's what she needed. That's what she needed. Needed dinner. Hello. You decided to join me? Yeah. I actually made this cat perch before I even had a cat. So you're welcome. I never knew I was going to get a cat. Uh, put those claws away. I don't know how I ended up with such needy pets. Do you think that's like a nature versus nurture thing? Do you think I've created them to be like this? Or do you think I just like attracted these type of animals? Because between you and Mooney and Monty, they're all very needy. Uh, Wolfie's the only one who's not needy. He just needs food, that's all. He doesn't need me. Or maybe that's why I kept her. Maybe I only keep the loving ones. When Moon was a puppy, I think I liked him the most because he would always come to me and I felt like he chose me. Sakura so gives love even though she's sassy sometimes. She's the most loving cat ever. You know that like conspiracy where iPhones start breaking down once the new one's coming out? I think it's not just like internal stuff. Like I feel like the camera also like loses quality. Like. I feel like it just gets so blurry and not as good quality as it used to be. Anyways, I want to show you guys these pills. They're not pills, they're gummies. I used to always take melatonin to go to bed and I went on a date when I was in England and this guy was like, oh, you shouldn't take like melatonin every single night. And I was like, well, I'm in England and I need to go to bed. So I need some help. And he was like, oh, you should take like a magnesium supplement. It's like more natural and like, better for your body and you won't be like addicted to melatonin or reliant on it. So I ordered some on Amazon and got them and they actually really work and they're so yummy. But I figured I'd just share that with you guys for anyone who struggles with sleeping. Anyways, I've been reading a bunch of your comments and I just love the community that I feel like this channel has. It seems like it's a lot of animal lovers, which I really love and appreciate to get your advice and your input on things and just like, I don't know, I feel like we all get each other. So I want you guys to know that if I don't respond, I do look at a lot of the comments. The videos are getting like thousands of comments, so it's hard to reply to everybody, but I do love reading all you guys' comments and everything that you guys say. So just know that I am always looking. So anyways, I'm going to end the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up and leave a comment. Maybe I'll respond. Maybe I'll just view it. But yeah, that's it for tonight. I love you. Until next, I'm tired to do that. I'm tired. I gotta go to bed. Good damn bye.